some of the people who've been on the, that list over time, uh, Adrian Peterson, and, and just in terms of, you know, did you did you did you read it and did you take kind of some pride in it? Uh, I mean, when I first found out, I was uh, eating breakfast with my dad, and he had an email saying I'm like, one of the top freaks. But I mean, you know, you know I mean, it has its fame and all that. But I mean, it, I mean, it definitely settled down and kind of, kind of got me even more motivated to, you know, do better and just work harder. But the fact that like they list me as a, a number two freak behind Clowney, Clowney's a good player, and you put me behind him, that's, that's that's cool. But you know, you have to prove it too. I mean, that was definitely in the off season too. So I feel like I have more of a chip on my shoulder to prove to people like, oh, he's supposed to be a freak. And, but I'm just kind of just kind of staying in my own lane and kind of developing my craft and kind of, uh, you know, just kind of, I mean, yeah, just uh, kind of being my own freak and just kind of being my own player right now. So. How do you define that word? How do you define freak? Yeah. Uh, man, uh, you know, being behind Clowney, I mean, a freak is just somebody who, you know, has that passion and just has that athleticism like nobody else that stands out on the field and just has that, like, that high-speed motor, you know, with Ferrari, you know, so I feel, you know, this, the word freak, you know, is definitely a uh, respected now these days, and somebody telling you a freak definitely, uh, you know, uh, is a compliment. Like a playmaker. Oh, yeah, most definitely playmaker, so. Speaking of Clowney, did you see the, the yesterday... Everybody's talking about how that hit he had against Michigan would be illegal under the new targeting rules. See, me and Clowney are the same height. I think he's 6'6". Six, six. And the fact is, like, I have to practice pad level all the time. And it's so hard, especially when you run across a running back that's so small. And, I mean, just to get that low in order to hit above, like, under his shoulders, is that the new rule? It, it's, it's, I mean, that's difficult. I have to find new ways to kind of uh, do that. But it's definitely difficult for uh, taller uh, defensive players to do that. So.